Hi everybody, welcome back to Don't Starve! Man, oh man, we live in exciting times. I don't know if you noticed uh, last episode, but holy shit. Uh, things got a little bit crazy, I turned into a beaver, I went on a rampage, I have no regrets. Uh, we did we did some fantastic work, uh, and it and it all it all worked out really really well, uh, and uh, we've got some spoils to go get. Holy shit! Uh, beyond all of my wildest dreams, I never figured that I could turn into a beaver, go on such a rampage, kill a keeper. Of the was that snarling? Did I just hear some snarling? Yes. Okay, I did hear some snarling. We're gonna have to get ready. It's day eleven. The dogs are coming. Uh, where's all my stuff? Try not to panic. All right, panic I will not do. Where's my spear? It's in. Uh, it's in my backpack, isn't it? I'm gonna have to put this like this. I have to put this back on. I have to get my spear ready. All right, you mangy dogs, come at me. Yeah, I'm not scared at all. I, I've got this. Uh, they're getting close. I mean, it does have to be said. I'm gonna get some boards ready too, just in case uh, there's lots of them. And I need to do uh, some fire lighting. I don't think it's going to come down to that, though. I mean, I'm a seasoned pro when it comes to dealing with dogs. I survived for like 180 days. That being said, I have no insurance policy against dogs. Uh, and I certainly don't have enough time to chop down 38 trees uh, in the time it's going to take for these dogs to... Uh, it's going to be a nighttime battle. The fire is roaring. That should see us through to the morning, hopefully, uh, if it doesn't rain. And, uh, and here come... There, there is definitely Woody. You're absolutely right. There's something out there, and uh, let me just forewarn you: it's, it's a dog. It's a dog who probably has rabies uh, and is snarling out there gently in the night, and it's going to make uh, some sort of homicidal beeline uh, for you. Here he comes. Look, uh, we got this. Look, we can totally tank him. Actually, I am a little bit low on health, and here's another dog. We could really do with not having another dog attack us. I don't think that's going to happen, though. I think that was it. I think we did it. Great. Uh, one dog attack down. <laughs> Any more to go. Unless we find the things first. That would be nice. Okay, great. Uh, we, we did it. We're, we're alive still. Uh, we can put some of this stuff back uh, in here, and we can collect uh, some of this other stuff. Do we need another chest? I think we do, actually. Uh, but we can probably take this potato thing and the crank thing uh, up to the uh, site of my rampage later on, maybe in uh, in day 12, when it becomes day 12. That might be nice. Uh, while we still have a little bit of light, I will carry on um, doing my gardening. I was doing some gardening before I was rudely interrupted by a pack of wild dogs. Look at this. I'm making a nice resource um, sort of um, fiesta, piñata over here, <laughs> kind of. I'm also making a line of grass tufts which is making me feel pretty good about myself. Actually, I'm feeling quietly confident that things are really going my way um, going into day 12. I don't think we're going to have any problem whatsoever getting Woody off of World 1. Uh, and actually, I'm quite pleased with uh, that as a goal. Let's eat some ratatouille to celebrate. There we go. Look at that. We have 42 health left. We could do with some more. We'll have another ratatouille just for good measure. We'll pick this one up off the crock pot and let us also uh, put some more crap into here such as this monster meat, a stale pomegranate, and maybe two berries. I have no idea what this is going to cook. And actually, in real life, I don't think I would ever use any of those ingredients for anything. Except for maybe berries. Berries? <laughs> berries I might consider. Monster meat, of course, doesn't exist in real life. And neither do pomegranates. So, there you are. You're stuck with berries? Hey! Holy shit! I made meatballs! <laughs> I fucking made meatballs! Can you believe it? Holy shit! What, what did we do for that? What did we put in there? A pomegranate? It was uh, one thing of meat. Uh, maybe let's put some of these crampy carrots in and some berries. Is that going to make more meatballs? I fucking hope so. I love meatballs. I, I don't mind admitting whatsoever that actually I quite enjoy a meatball. What's this? A hay wall? We don't want to make a hay wall. Actually, what we would like to make uh, before we go out uh, in day whatever it is, 12? Is it day 12? Oh shit, I wonder if I can shave my ginger beard off. Uh, there we go. More meatballs. Great. Uh, food is not a problem for us. We're going to put our food in the backpack. We're going to get our tools here. Let's also eat these stale petals. Even though they're stale, look, they give us a little bit of health back, uh, which is good. I mean, we need, we need health. We de desperately need some health. Uh, we can also do with planting a seed in here before we go. 
And let's also make uh, a little forest down here too. Uh, look at we've got the oh shit. <laughs> we've got the remnants of our wild night out as a beaver. Look, there's a whole bunch of just junk laying around here. Uh, let's also get Lucy. Oh shit, these, these carrots are going bad. We're gonna have to do something with these carrots. Actually, let's get them on here, and uh, we'll uh, we'll make sure that we don't actually waste them. Look, four bad carrots is gonna make one rotten ratatouille. I'm sure. Uh, it'll be worth it, though. Okay, let's just pick up all this junk. Uh, I'm going a bit insane. I could do with finding some flowers. That shouldn't be a problem. Uh, Lucy? Uh, I did! I haven't talked to you all day. I've been too busy. I've been really busy just trying to get on top of things after that uh, crazy time we had. I'm going to head up here, and I'm going to see about picking up some of the stuff. Whoa. I didn't actually mean to do that, and it scared me a little bit, too. Uh, I'm coming up here to check out all the stuff that we managed to possibly get and pick up some of this stuff that's just laying around, such as this big, big hunk of meat, which is slowly going bad, uh, and uh, any other food stuffs up here that may be going bad. I'm also going to collect uh, some stuff that I might need along the way too, and hopefully... Where is this place? Am I going the right way? No, I'm not. I'm going completely the wrong way. I didn't even mean to come this way. I've already wasted a quarter of day 12. I hope you're not too angry, and I mean, it goes without saying, I hope you're not offended by that either. Uh, if you are easily offended, and you do tend to get offended by somebody wasting a quarter of the day 12, I think maybe it might be time for you to check yourself before you wreck yourself, because that is, um, I, w I was going to say abnormal. It's not. I think it's excessive to uh, rip your dick off if somebody has wasted a quarter of uh, day 12 specifically. I don't think you need to worry about it. All right, we are now heading in the right direction. There is the king of the pigs. Uh, if we find any junk, we will be sure to give it to him. And of course, we also want to pick some wonderful flowers, which we will not only pick and gain some sanity back off of, but we'll eat the petals too for a nice boost of one health. Always nice. It's always nice to get at least one health. Um, there's a lone berry bush out here. Now, if only I could find my... There it is. My shovel. There we go. We can pick some berries and the bush. I'm looking forward to seeing that rotten ratatouille when we go back. We'll head back to camp uh, later on. Uh, day 12, I don't think we're going to do much exploring today, unfortunately. But at least we'll be able to... Oh, shit. You know, I came all the way up here. I totally forgot to fucking get... Bring the things with me. Also... Um, I forgot to bring a hammer. I was going to make a hammer so that I could start smashing down some of this stuff. I mean, we could just have a nice look in here anyway. Uh, see what we got. We've got a whole bunch of gears, which is nice. We sh should be able to make a fridge. Look at this pig's just like come outside and he's like, what the hell has happened out here? Well, listen, pig. I, I don't mind saying to you that uh, it was me. If, do you remember there was a man who kind of looked a lot like a beaver? was running around here and was owning everything left, right, and center, it was me. And I know you might be having a hard time believing that it was me, because now I just look like Sparkles from Area 11, the band, uh, also the Yogg's cast. But, um, but no, it, that was me in my, in my true form, my true beaver form. All right, I'm going to grab all these gears. Uh, I'm going to try not to stay here too long because my sanity is taking a bit of a hit because of these evil flowers. Uh, I think I need evil flowers for something, but I won't bother to pick any now because they're kind of gross. Uh, and if there's anything else over here that I can get, uh, possibly... Oh, shit, yeah, there's a whole bunch of living logs here. Uh, what can we drop? Let's just plant this berry bush. I'm going to make another base up here. I think it makes sense to have some sort of base up here. Uh, we can probably do... I mean, if I have the stones, I might even go as far as making a fire pit up here. Maybe even camping here tonight. Should I start picking some of these evil flowers so that they don't affect my sanity too much? I don't think it's going down too much at the moment. All right, let's eat these petals. Uh, I've got more than enough food to see me through tonight. Uh, we'll stay up here, and then we'll, uh, we'll see about doing some stuff. I think if I... Oh, shit, look, it, it affects your... What's that, 120? 100, whoa. It really affects it big time. I mean, it's good to have them, but what does this do? Oh, that also, okay, that affects your sanity too. All right, maybe I don't really want to do that too much. I mean, I don't really want to be stuck out here in the middle of the night around all this, all these evil flowers. Um, but I'm going to need something to keep, to keep the old sanity up while I pick them as well, uh, which is kind of annoying, actually. Oh, God, here we go. Jeez. This, this is a stressful game, isn't it? I mean, you can't get away from the fact that this is probably one of the most stressful games 
of all time. I, I don't, I, I'm going to say it. It is. I, I get very stressed out when I play this game. We're going to plant some of these. Uh, we still haven't found Chester, sadly. I mean, that is something that would be fantastic right now. Finding Chester, I think, would be one of the greatest things to happen. Uh, and, whoa, look at this. Two purple gems. Holy shit. Oh, we really did hit the mother load out here. All right. Um, I mean, we don't need to camp right next to the thing. Whoa, what's this? Oh, shit. Look at this. That is perfect. I was just saying before we got attacked by the dogs that I have no insurance policy. I now have an insurance policy, and it's right next to where I need to go to finish up my quest to get Woody off of this uh, land. God, that is fantastic. All right. Uh, well, this is uh, a remarkable place to make uh, a camp then, a permanent camp or, or somewhat permanent camp anyway. We're going to make one. We're going to get a fire pit out here. It'll be right in between. Uh, where we're going to uh, respawn if we die, and also where we need to escape as well. There, we got a fire. I'm going to quickly chop down all of this stuff so that it doesn't light up on fire. That would be nice. Uh, oh my god, Lucy is just having a whale of a time uh, with all this. God, she absolutely loves when I chop down trees and stuff. I mean, uh, who, who can blame her? Ah, oh, shit. Fucking, I'm going to eat these berries. Look, I'm eating them raw too. I know it's better to cook them. I know this, but I'm too lazy to cook them, and I would rather just eat them uh, as they are. All right, let's plant this, like, sort of over here. Uh, okay, well, <laughs> we planted a tree, and it sort of slid along the ground, uh, which was kind of cool. Uh, again, it sort of flew up in the air and slid on the ground. That is, that is quite the tree. I think that's a good sign uh, that it's going to be very healthy indeed, a very healthy tree. Okay, great. Uh, we didn't light everything up on fire. It's not quite a full moon, so we don't have to worry about going into full beaver mode. And uh, we've got all this other stuff. Do we? I wonder if you add... Uh, maybe we shouldn't. I think we need it for some stuff. I was going to add some... I want to see if maybe like a ghost comes out of the fire. Does... No, okay. We won't waste any more of those. <laughs> There's no ghost coming out of the fire. Uh, let us eat this ratatouille and... Uh, 63 health, 120 sanity. We're not doing too bad. Okay, Lucy. Talk to me. Y you're right, I'm back. I've been here all along. Look, I've got my farmer's hat on. I look a little bit angry, slightly deranged, uh, but don't worry. I'm, I'm, I'm perfectly fine. Hey, listen. So those noises are much louder than usual. Okay, great. It's day 13. Fantastic. Uh, do we have a... Oh, look, there's been some suspicious activity happening uh, in and around here in the night, uh, unbeknownst to me. It must have happened uh, just outside of... Oh, look at this! I've cleared out all of these flowers, and look, I'm no longer losing sanity. I mean, I do lose it when I pick stuff, but great, okay. We can maybe set up an yet another fire in here. <laughs> I'm, I'm tempted. I am tempted. I'm going to have to go back to my science machine and make a hammer first, though. Uh, and uh, also get those things so that I can put them on there and not have to uh, have them take up inventory space and uh, also other stuff. Uh, can I do this? I better not. I've got all of day 13, and I can't really afford to lose any more sanity than I've already lost, which is a bit of a shame. Uh, I won't dig up any graves uh, for the same reason, and if I can find some flowers and boost things back up, I should be fine. But it looks like that place uh, up there that we cleared out of enemies is nice and clear now, uh, which is perfect. And look at this. I found a whole bunch of flowers that I can boost my sanity with. Maybe uh, do some sort of sneaky exploring while I'm out here. No? Day 13? Sidetracking ever so slightly. I mean, I'm not, I'm not normally known uh, for being somebody who sidetracks. Uh, it's very out of character for me to uh, go off topic or indeed sidetrack while I'm playing a game. Uh, so I'm going to stick to what I said I was going to do, which is... Um, uh, is anyone... anyone re do you remember... Do you remember what I said I was going to do? Holy shit. I have found uh, the the ultimate fiesta of flowers. Great. I'm back up to 147 sanity. That's... Oh, shit. Shit. Don't fucking follow me. Oh, look at these poor pigs. Where the fuck did he come from? What the hell? Does my sanity still go down? If I'm, yeah, it does. Holy shit. He is on a fucking rampage. I mean... Opportunity knocks, though. Look, there's a whole bunch of perfectly good meat uh, being produced here by this guy. So long as he doesn't turn around and actually start killing me, uh, we should be fine. I've got this fire staff um, in a pinch, 
I can light him up on fire and probably also the rest of this. Do you know what? I'm going to come back for that meat after because I don't want that guy to just turn around and decide that I'm his next victim. I'm too young to die. Even though I've got a full beard and everything, I am much too young uh, to die. And let's uh, also, as a matter of principle, let's avoid that area too. We'll take the wormhole to get back up next time <laughs> now that I've got a lot of sanity. Holy shit.